camp, you motherfuckers! I'm gonna have a good time. I'm really excited. Camping. Outdoors. It's gonna be a good time. Really excited. Sorry about all the wind. I'm enjoying. Windows down, the sunroof open. Beautiful day out. Absolutely beautiful day out. I'm really excited. Come along, why don't you? It's like this whole field caught on fire out here. Probably an irresponsible smoker. Hey, there's more down here. Moldering about a quarter of a mile, a little further west from where they are right now. It's in the woods. I don't know. If... Yeah, yeah, further west, yeah. Uh, yes. Okay, thank you very much. Yep. It's in, it's in the, the medium, in the center. Yeah, all right, thanks, yep. All right, so I just got off the phone with um, 911, essentially. Uh, that fire, that extra little fire that was a little further up the road. I'm not sure if the firefighters knew about that, so uh, I just had to call it in and let their dispatcher know that there's another smaller one smoldering a little further west from where they are. So, um, yeah. So that's that. And uh, I think somebody else was calling me. But anyways, uh, if you're not sure, it's a good idea to take care of that. Don't, don't ever blow it off and well, someone else will get it, or oh, I'm sure they know it. No, because at that point, it was only about maybe 10 or 15 square feet that was uh, you know, smoldering on the ground. Uh, but pretty soon, that whole entire woods area is gonna go up in flames if nobody knows about it. So. Um, just take care of it. It's a simple little phone call. Talk to someone. Tell them everything that you know. What direction, you know, how further up from where they are the fire was. And, and you know, just give them whatever they need to know. It's no big deal. It's not going to run your day. Um, stuff like that needs to be done. It has to be taken care of. Otherwise, the whole highway will be shut down because of a humongous fire. And uh, whatever. It's for the cause. I can only guesstimate, you know. Maybe it was a piece of glass acting like a magnifying glass or something. Um you know, and started a fire. Uh, on the other hand, I'm more likely to think that someone tossed a cigarette butt out the window. And as dry as it's been lately, it's completely retarded and absolutely unnecessary. Hey folks, I am in the woods. It's where I wanted to be. And it makes me happy. Uh, Something over here is making a little noise. Let's check this out. Log pile here. What do we have going on here? I hear... Oh. You hear that? Somebody is obviously chewing this place to town. Let's see what we can find. Uh, it's coming from the outside here. Where the hell is it? Oh, looky there! There's a little, little pathway. 
this little dude would be dinner if I was absolutely starving, but it's not a big deal. Look, two of them. One there. Man. And then one off, where is it? In the background, right there. <laughs> Perfect. Those two are in great shape too. Oh my God. Look at that guy. Holy cow. Yeah, it's a, oh, you got a visitor there, there, buddy. Beautiful shot. Look what I found. Can you see it? I consider myself a fortunate person. If these are European honeybees, if they're Africans, I'm fucked. Donkey! What do you say there, buddy? Hmm? I don't mean, didn't mean to spook you. Come here, Holmes. Yes. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Get those nasty flies away. Those nasty flies away. You love a good ear scratch, don't you? You probably do. Yep. Don't you ever get the feeling you're being followed? Oh, re recording. Look, look, look. Ah. Damn it. Like a fox, I think. That's what it is. Dude, that's a little baby deer being chased down. What in the hell are you two? Probably some kind of very large moth. If I had to guess. Now, I won't be touching you. Because it could be very bad news. Or maybe you just look funny. Crazy though. Look at the size of that dude. Look at him. Compared to my finger. He's as big as my finger practically. Crazy. Wicked awesome. So I wanna relocate this dude. Not gonna happen there, Holmes. Um, 